Hey, what's up guys? This is Sohan and you are watching Technical Spark. In Windows 10 Beginner's Guide, today I am going to show you how you can record your screen using VLC Media Player. As I said, VLC can only be able to record your computer screen, not the audio. So to record the audio, we'll have to do some little hard work. But if in case you have the permission to install any software on your PC, then I have already created one video for free screen recorder. Just click on the i button at upper right corner and you are done. Or you may also check the video description for that specific video. So here I am assuming that you don't have permission to install any third application software on your PC. So very first, what you can do? Open the VLC Media Player on your machine. Once VLC Media Player is open, click on the Media. Go to the Open Capture Device. Or you can also press shortcut key which is Ctrl plus C. Once it open, in Capture Mode, select Desktop and set the FPS. FPS is like frame per second. So I'm going to keep it as a 25 because normally we shoot videos on 25 or 30 FPS. Now click on the arrow button and select convert. In convert source, as you can see, we are recording entire screen and in profile, make sure you have selected H.264, which is MP3 plus MP4. Now click on the setting button and verify that this mp4 option is tick marked. Click on save. Now browse the destination where exactly you want to save this particular video. So I'm going to keep it on my desktop. Test video and hit on save. Now next thing you will have to do is open voice recorder. In search bar type voice and your voice recorder will get open. In voice recorder, just turn this voice recorder on and same time turn this your VLC media player recording also on. Now as you can see your screen recording is got started and it's created one mp4 file on your desktop. Now open any uh, you know anything you which you want to record and just play some little bit of video. So for an example let me open this particular video. What's up YouTube? This is Sohan and you are watching video Technical started. Spark. In today's video tutorial, we are going to perform speed test on various browser for this 20. So that's enough. Now I have recorded almost 9 seconds of video. Now let's minimize this. Stop this audio recording and close the VLC media player. My video is recorded here. Let's play this. Okay, great. It's recorded very well. Now let's go to the voice. Open file location. And here is my recording file. Now let me close this. Let's play this simple recording file. Great. So from 54 seconds, my actual contents are loaded, which is my YouTube video. Now what we'll do is let's go back to the test video and we'll open video editor. Once video editor is open, just create new project, which is test video hyphen VLC and hit OK. Now we'll import the video. Just click on add or you may simply drag and drop. Okay, video is added. Now let's full screen this and click on place in storyboard. Okay, great. Now, now next thing we'll have to do is click on custom audio and we'll add the audio file here. So what was the location of our audio file? This is in Sohan Gole document sound recording. Documents and sound recording. So this is my audio file. Open. So I have seen the voice and video with this little bit of trick. Now click on done. And once video syncing is done, you can simply click on finish video. So I'll be exporting at high quality, which is 1080 pixel and click on export. So I'll be saving this on my desktop, new video, export. It will take some seconds to export the video. Now let's open the video. So my video is actually starting from 
here I guess yeah now let's play this video is started in today's video tutorial, we are going to perform speed test on various browsers. For this tutorial, okay, so that's enough. Great. So with the help of VLC Media Player, we have recorded our entire screen, and with the help of voice recorder, we have recorded the audio. And later on, with the help of video editor, we have merged video and audio. And here is our final video. And if in case you want this particular video to be more accurate, then what you can do? Just close this and again open the video editor, create one new project. So I will be giving this name as a 1. Click on OK. Add from this PC. So here is my new video which I just exported. Open. Place in storyboard. Now what we will do, we will trim this video. Now let's select the path. Okay, so from here we'll trim this entire screen. Click on once you selected the portion, click on done. This is 18 seconds of video. Now play this. this is Great. Now finish video, export 1.emp4 will be a name of this new video. Export. Close this. Now let's open this 1.mp4 video file. Video. This is Sohan and your video is started. I hope guys now you have understood how I record videos using VLC. I completely agree there is a little bit of hard work which you have to do while syncing your audio and video. And if you don't want to waste your time in these settings then click on the i button or check out my video description for the free software where I have demonstrated each and everything on how to record your audio and video with a simple steps. Friends, now I hope now you will be able to record your display along with the voice using VLC media player. If in case you have any question, queries or feedback, please feel free to type in the comment box below. If you found this video useful, please hit on the like button and don't forget to share and subscribe. This is Sohan signing out.